What's up everyone? Hope y'all are doing well and I wanted to first start this video by saying thank you for all the support and amazing comments y'all left on the previous video. Truly means everything to me and I couldn't wait to get started on a part 2 for this series. So today we are doing glove knife combos in CS2 with a budget of $1000 or less and I'm very excited to show some of these combos because they are quite unique. Two things before we get started. All gloves and knives shown in the footage are the exact where that is discussed. And I also use pricing from sites like CS Flow and Skinport way more than buff so the price is way more accurate for a lot of the viewers. With that being said, let's just jump straight into our first combo. Alright, so our first combo is coming in at around $910 total. And we're going to be rocking the Omega Fuel Tested gloves with a Falchion Lore in Factory New. So, first off, Omega Gloves in CS2, they have this nice, you know, shiny look to them. They pop with the yellow. And uh, you might be wondering, why did I go so heavy on, like, the glove price versus the knife? Well, I think these two just match incredibly well. So, Falchion Lore, very bright. The new animations on the right click is really, you know, sick. But uh, notice how, like, we've got the metal part on the Falchion Knife where you hold it and it matches the gray on the glove. And then the yellow matches, you know, the yellow that we see, the yellow pieces on the Omega Gloves that we see, they go hand in hand with the, like, pattern that we see on the Falchion Knife. I mean, it's very bright, but it's also very clean at the same time. And, uh, I think this is a super cool combo. If you want to rock something yellow and gray, this is an awesome combo. Alright guys, moving on to number two. At a total of $730, we're going to go with overtakes in minware which means they're going to be very clean and a stiletto tiger tooth in factory new so y'all asked me to uh include a uh, stiletto in this video and i definitely listened so i went with a stiletto tiger stripe for this one because a obviously matches really well with the uh, the overtake gloves once again i think overtakes are an incredible deal and uh, you know 210 bucks for a minware pair is perfect now let's take a look at the handle real quick look at the stiletto handle you see how it's like grayish it's got this like brownish color oh it's perfect because the overtake glove the main color on the overtakes is the same color so it matches perfectly the tiger tooth finish is very bright very flashy i mean uh and uh whenever you pair it with the overtake gloves i think it makes for a beautiful combo yeah this is for all you stiletto enjoyers out there coming in at number three uh, we're gonna be on the dot with the budget. We're actually at $1,000 flat. And you guys might recognize this, but it's a little bit different. So we've got overprints gloves in a uh, fuel tested mixed with a flip knife gamma doppler phase four. So with the uh, gamma dopplers, usually it's the phase three that has cyan, but crazy enough, the one that you guys are looking at is a phase four. When I found it myself, I was like, holy, the entire knife is cyan. And that literally could not go better with the uh, overprints. Now, obviously, I did include this in the previous video. However, I feel like everybody, mostly everybody, likes the flip knife more than the gut knife. And especially when the entire flip knife is this amazing, bright, cyan color. It, it just looks stunning. Um, honestly, this is one of the most insane combos I've seen in CS. And it's under $1,000. You know, there's a ton of combos that are super expensive. This one is beautiful. And uh, if you guys are wondering, the pattern of this knife is... Uh, 500 if you guys want to copy this look that pattern's 500 all right for number four uh we're gonna be at 710 dollars so you know pretty far from the 1000 dollars budget but uh we're gonna be going with imperial plaids in field tested mixed with the ursus ultraviolet in minware so in cs2 we really have two good purple gloves and that's the pandoras and the imperial plaids pandoras start at like i think two or three grand something ridiculous and uh, the other choice you have is Imperial Plaids, which I think people sleep on. Imperial Plaids are so nice. Very deep shade of purple. They're uh, pattern based. And uh, the inner palm has this really cool, like, bright purple color. And th they're just so sleek overall. So, you know, I had to match that with something that's equally as clean. And uh, we went with a Ursus Ultraviolet. As you guys can see, the handle is the same exact color as the Imperial Plaid. And the uh, gray finish on the blade itself accompanies the glove and knife perfectly. This is a very clean combo. If you want purple and you want something just like not over the top but elegant, this is definitely the look for you. Alright, so coming in at number 5 at $900, we're going to go with a Fade Gloves uh, in Fuel Tested mixed with the Bowie uh, Doppler in Phase 1. I don't really like recommending the Bowie knife if you're going to get gloves because as you guys can see, there's no second hand, right? However, 
Here's the cool thing about fake gloves. They're there's different they're pattern based and uh, you can get a completely separate right hand to the left. So what I did here was I matched a Bowie Doppler, right? That is this very shiny, very, you know, big blade, very good looking knife. And um, you know, we've got the blue and the pink. And what I did was I found a specific pattern and there's a lot of those on the these types of gloves that you can get and uh they're basically going to be purple and pink as you guys can see where it's just like the the tortu logo on the gloves it's the exact same color scheme as the knife and uh and it doesn't matter what's on the left hand because we only see one hand and so that makes for a really cool combo and check it out so whenever you actually inspect the bowie even on the fingers and the inner cuff it has the exact same color scheme if you look closely the cuff and the fingers have the same cool, you know, purple blue look to them or pink and purple look to them as the knife. And so super shiny, you know, uh, very pretty and elegant uh, knife combo. And this one's for you Bowie enjoyers out there. Number six, and I think this is one of the most unique ones that actually took me forever. Uh, we're going to be rocking the field agents in field tested mixed with the uh, flip knife marble fade and the marble fade specifically has to be a combination of blue and yellow that that's how it works right so we know the marble fade is three colors red blue yellow however there are certain patterns on the flip knife that are just blue and yellow and that matches the field agent gloves incredibly it's it's a really cool combo i i, I have barely seen this before and uh if you guys are wondering, the pattern on this flip knife right here is 409. Shout out to Luke uh, for helping me out with this one because I was stuck. But yeah, you know, if you like this yellow and blue look, this is pretty cool. You will never see anybody else in game with this type of combo. It's super unique. And uh, once again, the marble finish on the flip knife is very bright. And I, I, I think this is a really, really cool combo that's not seen a lot. So I will absolutely recommend it for sure. Moving on to number seven. We've got polygon gloves in minwear mixed with a Ursus Doppler uh, Phase 4. So the total cost for this is $970. And you guys might recognize the Phase 4 finish with these gloves from the previous video. However, that was on the Navaha. The Navaha did not do this finish and glove combo justice. This blade is four times larger. It's sleeker, it's cleaner. You see more of the pattern, the, the black and the blue. And when you just combine it with these polygon gloves, they're gonna look amazing. Not to mention polygon gloves, these right here are minwear, which means they're basically going to be perfect. Once again, as always with the Dopplers, very bright, very shiny, and uh, the, the color combo between this is super sleek. If instead of the Navaha, you, you know, you have a little bit more money to spend, I highly recommend this glove knife combo right here. Moving on to number eight, we're going to be going with the Cool Mints Moto Gloves and Field Tested mixed with a Nomad Knife Blue Steel and Factory New. Total price of this is about $880. And I saw a couple of you guys mention that the Blue Steel finish got like a rework in CS2, so I wanted to include it. And here's a pretty cool combo that I found. The Blue Steel finish, you, you wanna get it as low as possible because uh, it's gonna match the glove a lot better. Uh, as you can see, this like very gray blue color that we see on the gloves matches the Nomad Knife really well. And when you inspect it, you know, you've got the gray bits on the actual handle that match the, the gloves as well overall i think these gloves are super slept on they're very clean i like the color scheme and the knife is very elegant as well this is once again one of those clean combos it's not over the top it's not in your face but it's just clean and you can always look at it and appreciate it all right so moving on to number nine we have Eric sports gloves in field tested mixed with the paracord knife case harden in minwear and uh, total price is about $920. As you guys can see, the paracord knife right here, this is a gold gem. There's plenty of patterns that you guys can look at that you'll find at market price that will have a ton of gold, maybe a couple of spots of blue, but it will still look equally as shiny. This is one of the better patterns, obviously, but uh, it will still look equally as good for market price. Take a look at how unbearably bright that gold gem. This gold gem looks like the, the undying power of the sun god. I don't know what's going on, honestly, but uh, it is incredibly bright. I chose the paracord because it's got this like, as you guys can see when you inspect it, it's got this like wrap, um, this like paracord wrap on it that really matches the inner glove of the air it's really well because it's got this like digi camo and uh overall once again another unique combo we're gonna move on to the last one here for our last and final glove combo of this video we're rocking the scarlet shama field tested i hope i pronounced that right but uh scarlet shama with the classic knife slaughter in factory new as you guys can look the handle of the classic knife is actually gray 
matching perfectly with the sports gloves. And then we have this pink on the slaughter. Now, if you guys remember, Scarlet Chamas in CSGO were like red. They were pretty much red gloves, and I don't know what happened, but now they're, I'd say they're more pink than, than red, which basically made it match with slaughter knives way better. And uh, that's why I paired the two together. You know, they share the same exact color scheme. Really cool um, thing about this combo, and th this took me forever to find, but uh, as you guys can see, the classic knife only knife in the game that has the idle animation. And when he idles it, he basically grabs it with his thumb. And if you guys can look really closely, the pattern I chose specifically looks like when he grabs the blade, it like leaves a mark. If you guys can see that, it's, it's like a thumbprint left on the slaughter finish. Cool little Easter egg for this finish. If you guys are wondering, this uh, pattern right here is 92. I looked at about 300 patterns to find this one specifically. So that one's 92. Very nice red combo. If you're going for a red inventory, I would highly recommend this glove knife combo. Here's all 10 of the combos I have for y'all today. And I would love to hear from you guys on how y'all feel about them. Or if y'all have any of your own suggestions that I should try out in game. I really tried to stay away from mainstream combos we have seen many times before. And hope there were at least a few y'all haven't seen before. We will be hosting a CS2 crafting challenge in our Discord server very soon, and the winner will be receiving a glove knife combo as the prize, so y'all should definitely check out the Discord in the link below. With that being said, thank you guys for watching and have an amazing Tuesday. Peace out, guys.